Have you ever noticed a special team of hosts and hostesses at Taiwan's National Day? This etiquette team are on hand to guide guests through the ceremony and smooth over the experience. This year, the team has a special member, Jirapat Unaha from Thailand. He's studying travel and tourism at Ming Chuan University and is passionate about everything service related. We spoke to the accomplished international student about life in Taiwan and his hopes for the future. With wide smiles and coordinated gestures, a company of young etiquette staff is a fixture at the annual National Day celebrations. They are everywhere at the event, guiding and welcoming guests. For 39 years, the etiquette staff ambassador team from Ming Chuan University have held the important job. Now they have a star student who's also an immigrant. Good morning, everyone. My name is Alex. Fluent in four languages, Jirapat Unaha came to study Mandarin at university in Taiwan. He likes to work with groups of people and chose the International Institute to major in travel and tourism. Now in his second year, he's joined the National Day Etiquette staff team. I'm very interested in the service industry, so I thought, if I get the chance, I'd like to join the team. It will teach me how to be a professional host, and I will get more opportunities to go to all kinds of events and get more service experience. I've served dignitaries from Thailand. When I saw their faces and their Thai names, I immediately started using Thai with them, and they seemed very happy to have a Thai student serving them. To perform at his best, he practices his posture and his Chinese in the mirror every day. He keeps fit by practicing Muay Thai. But one Taiwanese street bursts his image as a fitness fanatic. His first love in Taiwan was bubble tea. Taiwanese bubble tea is not the same as Thai milk tea. Taiwanese milk tea has boba in it that you can chew. It's fun and casual. As part of the etiquette team, Jirapat Unaha has had an unusual experience of studying in Taiwan. He says in the future, he would like to join the airline industry as a flight attendant or work in a hotel in Taiwan. Any team would be lucky to have his professionalism and warmth to count on.